This is Laura from Riverside Food Tours. I'm making a little video today to show you how to use the Finley Market app. For the past three weeks, we've actually done a virtual tour from Finley Market of all the different Finley Market vendors. And it's been a lot of fun to get to know the business owners and see the items that they showcase and hear a little bit about their story. Now, if you're like me, you're probably anxious to try some of their food items but this might not be the best time to go down to Finley Market. Um, you might not have the time, you just might not feel safe. Although I do want to mention that Finley Market is open every day, normal business hours except Monday, and they are practicing social distancing. But if you don't want to go, I get it. So the app makes it really fun to just shop at home and peruse the different vendors and what they have to offer. So let's get started. So you go on your um, app, iPhone or tablet and go to the App Store and you would download the Finley Market Shopping app. It's a bright green or dark green box with a little red center. So I have it here at the bottom. I'm going to click on. So um, it took me right to the opening page, but if you were to do this for the first time, it would give you a selection of pickup or delivery, what day you wanna pick it up, and you also get $5 for your first order. So that's kind of fun. Then it brings you to the home page. Across the top are 21 different Finley Market vendors. So this is not all the vendors in Finley Market. They're adding more, but for now, there's 21, a nice selection. So you can click on any one of these vendors and just shop from their items. This is particularly helpful, for instance, I like, um, um, the rind. So maybe I just want to get my cheese all from the rind. So we just click on the rind and shop their cheese selection. Now below that is a lot of different categories. So as we scroll down you'll see produce categories and meat and vegetables and cheese and bakery and bread and dairy and desserts and just on and on and on. So let's say you're just shopping for produce today. So just you just stay in the produce category and the produce actually comes from various vendors. It comes from either maybe Roth, maybe ETC, maybe Madison Grocery, and it will designate which vendor you're buying this from. So now what else is interesting, and you see here, there's a lot of private selection items, Kroger items, and that confused me. I didn't understand why were they having regular grocery items. I thought this was a Finley Market app until I found out that Finley Market is in conjunction, this app with greenmarket.com. And they've done that for your convenience so that you not only can shop the Finley Market merchants, but you can also pick up some grocery supplies. It's a one-stop shopping experience, so that's kind of nice. Now, there is a $25 minimum order when you're using this app, and um, but it's just so convenient because right now, um, we're all kind of stuck at home. We're doing everything virtual, and it's just a fun way to get acquainted with the Finley Market merchants. So once you've completed your order, you would go to your shopping cart and it lists your items. You can still edit, add or subtract, and then you go down to the payment. So once I hit the payment, I put my card in, it completes the order. One final step that I thought was a little confusing, you will see a skinny green bar at the bottom of the page. You hit that skinny green bar that takes you out of the ordering page and that sends your email confirmation with all your details as to when, where you're gonna pick up your order. So the orders are picked up on Tuesday through Friday nights or late afternoons from four to seven. And I actually placed an order a couple days ago. So we're going to go this afternoon and pick up our order so you can see what it's like to pick up the order at Finley Market. So stay tuned, we're going there next. Hi, so we're here at Finley Market. We're actually standing in the north end of the public lot. It's a nice sized lot, plenty of spaces, and it's a little after four. Pickup begins at four. So they have all the orders loaded into the truck behind me. So in just a few seconds, we're gonna walk over there, get in line, pick up our order, and we'll be on our way. And we'll yes. Yes. Hey, we have number two in the coast, right? Yes. Um, if you could, you could, yeah. Hi, 
Hi, so we're back home from Finley Market and I have my groceries all spread out on the counter. I just want to show you how much you can get. This order was $66. I got my $5 off coupon. So I think I did pretty well. I got a lot of produce from Roth Produce. I got spring mix, cauliflower, green onions, potato, celery, and carrots. I got some tea from Churchill's. I got some English muffins from Blue Oven, some cream cheese. I got some special spice from Colonel D's. I'm gonna use this on salmon. I got two pounds of best ground beef from Eckerlands. I got a bag of Cristini and some cheese from the Rind. This is a fresh pasta from Beauchard's and their homemade sauce. I got a lot of cheese from Gibbs. I got a big, I think a pound of the Wisconsin cheddar. I got Munster. I got their sliced ham. I got a pound of butter. And I've got um, chicken salad from Silver Glades. So all of these things, just a little over $60. So, you know, you can do a stay at home food tour. You don't have to buy a box. You don't have to have somebody do it for you. Just go on the app, pick and select the items you want and get creative. You know, that's a great time to start trying all the different Finley Market merchants. And you saw how easy it was to pick it up. So you know, maybe you just want to get out of the house and go for a little ride. You know, it's no must, no fuss to come down to the parking lot, get out, pick up your orders. So until we meet you again on a food tour, I hope this has been helpful and um, I've enjoyed making this video. Thanks for watching. Gee.